This year at the Henry Moore Studios and Gardens we are showcasing 21 works outdoors and all of these works have been selected with this theme of vitality in mind. And vitality is this word that Henry Moore uses frequently when he talks about his work. Um, and it comes from this um, word meaning life and for more it sort of means a power and energy, this sort of animation of life that he wants to really charge all of his works with and in particular his sculpture. The exhibition Vitality will take you across the entire estate which form the grounds on which Moore's former home and his studios where he lived and worked and in that experience you will encounter some semi-abstract works that may initially seem surprising or unusual. You will encounter some figurative works but those that are related to the landscape, related to the natural formations of hills or mountains or caves or boulders. And in all of this work, we'll see that this thread of what Moore felt was so important, this energy, this vitality, is one that connects not only the works to one another in a beautiful way, and hopefully those connections will be revealed as you move through the, the landscape, but also that they connect very strongly sculpture to the earth, to the landscape, and also to our own human bodies and the way that we navigate the world around us. Moore often um, talks about this tendency that he has to humanise everything. So to look at mountains and rocks and hillsides and caves and to see in them the human body and the body, you know, and, and to sort of imbue that sense of uh, the landscape into his figures and to relate people and their torsos to tree trunks, for example. And we can see that quite specifically, I guess, in work such as two-piece reclining figure points, which is in the exhibition this year, and it's wonderful to have it back here. And this is a work which, you know, individually these two parts of the body look like they're balanced, poised, but they could be sort of unearthed, huge rocky boulders or these enlarged pieces of jagged flint. Together, Moore has sort of placed them to look like a, a reclining figure, but individually they sort of definitely have this earthly landscape quality. And even more vitality is kind of, uh, kind of instilled in this work because they have intervening space between these two parts is animated by these points that almost touch but don't quite touch. And this is really more talking about that sort of the human landscape connections that we might all feel somewhere very deep down in our kind of core. What is so nice about this exhibition is that it is all outdoors. So unlike walking into a museum, gallery, this is an exhibition that will unfold and reveal itself as you walk through the landscape here, sheep fields, through garden, and hopefully will allow the viewer that wonderful time to reflect and to appreciate what Moore's trying to achieve in his work, this sort of pent up vital energy.